Hello, Wasatch kids. Uh, Mrs. Lee here. Today I'm going to teach you how to make paper wallets. Um, first, you have to have the paper ready. Uh, you can use any paper. This is my old bent up copy paper. Or if you don't have that, you can just tear a page out of the notebook and just trim the rough edge and use that. But we have to start with a triangle to make, uh, not, I'm sorry, not triangle, square. To make the square, you fold the paper like this, and we will have to um, get rid of this extra part. So cut along this edge of the triangle with scissors. You will not need that part. Okay. And open it up, and you have a perfect square. Okay. Okay, first, we will fold this down into half and make that into a rectangle like that okay now fold it again and open it up okay now we will fold the right edge to the center line and left edge to the center line okay now we will put our index finger right into that corner there, okay? And then push it down to make a triangle tip. Now that side looks like a little house. We repeat the same thing. Put your index finger all the way in here, push it down to make a little house. We have two houses. Okay. Make sure this top center line and the bottom center line matches. Okay. okay, then we will fold this bottom up to the bottom of the roof of the house and then fold it again. Okay, okay one side is done. Now we're going to turn the whole thing over. Fold the right edge to the center. Left edge to the center. Mm -hmm. Repeat the same thing. Bring the bottom up to the bottom of the roof shape. Okay. And then fold it again. Okay. So here is the paper wallet. Okay. You can decorate this with crayons, color pencils, markers, whatever you have in your house. And I use the red marker to put the geometric designs on here. Okay. Now, if you start with a nice origami paper, uh, you can make something this pretty. But it does not have to be origami paper. You can use any colored paper or even a wrapping paper. Uh, and, but make sure when you start it, uh, the paper start as square. Okay. All right. And also, if you um, make this bigger, 14 by 14 inches, that size will hold, uh, will hold the, the actual money, paper money. So you can use it as a real wallet if you want to. Okay, that's it. Thank you and I will see you again soon.